Hello friends, how are you? Welcome back to the Gear Institute's YouTube channel. Today topic is about table drilling machine parts and it's working. So let's understand it. We have a drilling machine here. This is called a table drilling machine because you can keep it on the table and do the drilling. Hence its name, table drilling machine. So, let me tell you about its parts. This is our main table, above which we have a holder. This holder helps to hold the job, that you want to drill. And here we have these columns. This column is written as pillar in many books and known as columns. Here are the handles, you can see it, you can move it up and down. There are movements because of which it goes up and down. And here we have the chuck, it is called the drilling chuck. You can increase the tightness, by moving it, or by loosening it. The drill which we have, we need to fit it here, and tighten it. You can keep it here, and tighten it. Here, we have a key, with which we can tighten it. You can see it here, you need to tighten it in this way. The drill which we have tightened here, is of 10 millimeters. Okay. I will show you more parts of it. So here we have step pulley. It is a step pulley and has two parts. One is this and one is this side. You can see the above parts of these two. If this is big, this is small. If it is small size then it will change. Here this is the smallest part then here it is the largest. So the step pulley change the velocity ratio. And here we have motors to which we have given AC power. So whenever we need more power, what will we do that we will run bigger pulley with small pulley? We have connected it with belt and it is like V-belt pulley. Here I will show you how it works. Now we will drill. I have this job now. I want to drill 10 millimeters on it. I will keep on top of this, and tighten it. If you want to set it, then you can tighten the table, with the help of these handle. Wherever you want to set it, you can adjust by moving the table, and tightening it, by bringing to the required position. So you have to do the marking first here. After doing the marking on the job, and bringing the drill exactly on top of it. You have to tighten it in this way. So this has become tight now. Now we will start the drill. We have this drilling machine and see how we are drilling it. We use lubricant or cutting oil to run it. Normally we use cutting oil, but now we have water. So we are using water. This is how we drill. We have done 10 millimeters drill. Accordingly you have to drill as you need. <laughs> 